Ladies and gentlemen, it is I, Vermillion, as always. Today we're playing Liminal Gallery. This is a game that's trending right now. I'm not sure exactly what the premise of it is, but we're going to give it a shot. So I want you guys to sit back, relax, and enjoy some Liminal Gallery. Okay, so... So far we are... Let me get my camera right. Sorry, let me zoom out. I'm at the studio, by the way, as you can see in the background. After this, we'll be going to the gym. Okay, let's turn this off. I hate music. Even though we're in a music studio. <laughs> no photos or videos, welcome to Cal. Let's just go ahead and proceed. Push the bar open. Okay. Open door. Click to activate. Okay, so this is one of the games, I believe, where you interact with the... What the fuck? Okay, we're in the back rooms. We know clipped. Uh, okay. I feel like my camera's still weird. Right, but uh, as I was saying before, I believe this is one of the games where you, like, use reality and manipulate it or something. Hold to aim. Hold right. Okay. So we're supposed to go somewhere with this, right? Use to accept. restart okay okay I get it I get it so it's like a puzzle game we're using our environment or things from our environment and we're recreating them and we're using that to progress through the level it's pretty cool pretty cool uh, I need this to be down all right right here yeah can I crouch something like that <laughs> all right so the, this concept is pretty cool because another game also did this, and I believe that game was called Super Super Liminal or something like that, Subliminal. That was a great game. Um, came out a while ago. Though. Use mouse to rotate. Okay. So do we have to put this in the picture frame, or we can just put it anywhere? Uh, I say we just put it here. Okay, go. Whoops. I hope there's no, like, active enemies or some shit, because that would be a nightmare. Did this get out of the way? Thank you. Crouch. There is no crouch, so you just gotta restart. Alright. I get it, I get it, I get it. And we can run. That's not a good sign. <laughs> that is not a good sign. Okay. Let's just place you... There. Go. It's like just barely not doing it. That's kind of annoying. Okay, that was weird. You gotta kind of move the watch him call it out of the way. The picture frame. We just put this here, right? Anyway. This blackness is that like a void? Yes, it is. Okay. Not doing that again. I, I don't know why I did that. Hard to restart. The music is pretty, pretty damn eerie, if I do say so. Why is it like that? I have no idea. Damn, this is kind of freaky. Can I go in? Right, I don't think I glitched it out. I'm gonna restart. Um, it feels like the Matrix almost. The games like this just feel like the Matrix to me. I don't know why. Is it doing that? Do I have to have it on the wall or something? Yeah, I'm guessing I just need to line it up identically with this. Yeah, like that. No? Okay, we're gonna try it again. It reminds me of like, uh, something like you could bend reality and the Matrix is exactly that. Oh, why is it doing that? Oh, we're going this way. I'm tripping. I just wasted so much time just tweaking. Okay. Take this. And we'll stick you... Here. That's freaky. Another one? Okay. So far, no jump scares, which I'm happy about. More guys. I guess we're just going to keep doing this. 
I feel like we're the lore of this is like we're some photography student who went out to you know get some research done at a museum for some kind of project and uh, we landed in the back rooms I can't get that one I have to shoot it back here maybe I can oh I can take that one I'm guessing I have to uh, use a wormhole to climb up there or something let's put it here or let's go all the way back and try that okay that's absolutely not what we're supposed to do I think let's keep walking and see is this infinite that would be fucking crazy if it was infinite oh it's not That looks like a ladder piece or something. That'll get us to the next phase. Staircase, awesome. Even better than a ladder. Cause I can't, or I used to not be able to get on ladders for some reason. I was one of them kids where uh, the ladder, if even if somebody was holding it at the base, the ladder was just too much for my little brain cause I would uh, freak out. Heights were a big thing back. I, I overcame that though. I did rock climbing. I did a few other things to overcome that. Okay, what's this? Stairs. We're gonna put them here. It should get us to the painting, right? Broken. We gotta restart. I see where this is gonna be a problem now. It's gonna be a lot of uh, tediousness. All right, we'll put this over here. Just to get that out of the way. I'm probably gonna end up skipping ahead on something like this, just, you know, so we don't keep going back and forth over and over with the same stuff. But so far, I really enjoy the concept. I never played the other game super liminal, but this one looks pretty nice. We're gonna grab this again for the second time. Okay, walk back. Or oh, I forgot we could sprint. Let's sprint back. We were taking our sweet dawn before. Black and white choice with the monochrome is interesting too. It gives it a more bland kind of vibe. Okay, uh, that should do it, right? I don't need to be just that high on it. I can still grab it like that. Put this here, and we'll leave. We'll go into the forest, or not. That would have been so raw if we could actually like leave and go to a completely different map. That is asking a lot from a game though. Okay, this one did not come out right. Can I still get in? Yes. Awesome. I did not feel like restarting this one. <laughs> Damn, it's so trippy and so dark and desolate. Next stage though. Oh, this is water. I didn't even notice that. You can hear it sloshing around, but it felt, it like doesn't look like it's moving at all. It's kind of odd. Uh, it's very dark. This way. I think I started that way. So let's go this way. I feel like I could be jump scared at any moment. I am not gonna lie to you. Let's just put this here. Oh my god, this is... This is like a nightmare, like a, a kid's nightmare. Or like a twisted painting you'd see at a doctor's office. And you'd come home and have a nightmare because you got a shot that day. Or some shit like that. What's in here? A new painting. Okay. Can I put this on this wall? No. It's so far off. Going backwards is even more terrifying, like how dark and not lit it is. That's wild. That is so wild. Okay. But so far, I'm just praying we don't get jump scared. They said it was a 10, 15 minute, I died. Okay, we restarted. Oh, I keep the painting. That's pretty nice. That's pretty sick. This yet, but they said it was a 10, 15 minute experience, so. I'm not really tripping, I don't think we're gonna run into any devastating scares. 
and it's a nice little video. We can take a break from the big mainstream horror games we've been playing, aka the Granny series, which I hated, by the way, just because the the footage was just the oh shit. That better not be an enemy. Well, it's just the spider, so... Thankfully, it's just the... <laughs> oh, okay. That's a lot of foreshadowing. That's gonna be a guy coming out of that painting. We gotta be careful. I can sprint. The foreshadowing is real. Fuck. Oh, he didn't chase us. I did get a fuck ton of goosebumps right there. <laughs> My god. He could still be in the map, though. We don't know. Let's run. We'll run through the darkness. Oh, I'm not liking this. This is the creepy zone. This is the scary, scary, spooky zone. Let's just run through it. Okay. You can look at me all you want. As long as you don't try nothing, as long as you don't jump on me, we're, we're cool. That's fine by me. Oh, man. How do I get up here? Just go for it. They're not here anymore, so I think we're safe. Don't jump scare me at the last second. Okay, awesome. Next stage. Is this a Kodak camera? That's it. So now we get probably what I would deem as a new... Oh, what the hell? A new mechanic. We take a picture. And place the new painting there. Fall. Nope, we missed it. I guess we put that under our feet and then we just fall directly down. Did it restart? Oh, okay. The camera just spawned me in a weird location. Okay. Maybe I should just go like this. Yeah, this is how you do it. Now I can lay it down directly in front of me. We can easily pass. Awesome. This is a very creative design. Okay, work. A new camera? What's this? Camera film. Oh, so that's like a reload charge or something. So we take this photo, and then we just flip this. Anything above us? No. I would love to see something like this in a... Okay, that's kind of annoying. Let's restart. I would love to see something like this in a AAA game. Like... I have to get closer. Let's get close. Let's do it like that. Yeah, like a AAA game where mechanics are like this, and maybe you get to, like, fight opponents with this kind of style. You guys just... Duke it out with different... Damn, I, I'm fucking this up bad. Uh, let's do it again. Yeah, but you get to fight different opponents and... I don't know, make this work as a mechanic. That would be so cool. I guess I have to put it like... Here, right? Yeah, okay. We have to walk down into it. It's a very creepy puzzle aesthetic. Alright, how, how are we gonna do this one? How are we gonna do this? Maybe... Maybe we have to walk on this beam or something. Okay, well first let's... Let's do this. Take a picture. Maybe we can put it on the ground and just fall into it. Let's try that. I think that was a good idea, though. Okay, try it again. Place this, place this, bam. We can go in. I thought that was going to be way more complicated. Like, we would have to climb on pillars and stuff. <laughs> Thank God it wasn't. That's, puzzle games are not your boy's forte. Um, I took on Amanda the Adventurer. I did not like that because of the puzzle aspect. There are so a few other games I think we played 
on the channel where there were a horror puzzle and the puzzle part just escapes me it's just not it just doesn't fit with your boy how does this work you have to just place it down here and fall into it maybe oh we got that nice that was kind of sick actually that was kind of sick yeah this one is kind of crazy Okay, F. Whoop, I don't know why I said F. Oh, it's not that crazy. Wait, maybe it is. Oh, maybe you just keep taking pictures of the. Can we open it like this? I think. Yeah, we can. I like how it's not restrictive at all in that capacity. There's a lot we can do. Uh, this doesn't look right, does it? We have to override this gate thing. Maybe we take a picture of the floor, place it up, and then walk over this or something. Is that gonna work? Oh, yeah, that will work. We just gotta do it right this time. That will definitely work. Picture. being a little too ambitious. We gotta find another way to do this. Um, maybe I can zoom in or something. This might take me a while. I'm gonna have to play with this one. I guess we just brute forced our way through that one. I don't know how they gave that to us. But we literally just stuck this on the side and kind of just walked against it. I don't know. Let's, we could try it again. Maybe it'll work. Yeah, what the hell? I guess we're onto something. We're getting kind of good. They're giving us a lot of photos here. So we need multiple pictures of the staircase? Is that what I'm saying here? Let's put one there, right? This is actually so raw. Like, the concept of this game is so interesting. Okay, I get it now. They gave us a bunch of these so we can kind of chain our way up. That is so crazy. Let's take a front on of this, just in case we need it up ahead. We probably will. Yeah, we're definitely gonna need that, okay. I just glitched off, damn. This is actually crazy. Okay, climb up that, climb down this, awesome. And we need another, we needed another picture. I forgot about that. This, this one should suffice here. This one should suffice. Never mind. Can I get up this? Oh, we, we ruined the level. Alright, we gotta restart. We gotta restart. Let's just do it this way. Do this one. I feel like this is the best method. 
No, it's not. That's bad. So we gotta take these side. Side is the best way to do this. take a couple more of these or we can what we can do is we can run back down and run out of them and just keep taking more snapshots and then boom we'll hit this one like so yeah it it's kind of difficult to tell what it's going to clip out but let's go grab grab our last piece here. Four, what, one, two, four looks like it'll be enough. Four pictures. We'll put this one, we have to put it over here. Is that going to fuck with that? No. Like so. Make it. We made it. Okay. Okay. Hmm. I like the peacefulness of this one. And I'm kind of, I'm low key, I'm starting to get swayed over to the, the dark appeal of this. Like the darkness, the slow, winding kind of music. It's starting to do something to me. Not like in a good or bad way, but it's kind of accustoming itself to me. If that's even the right way to, to say what I'm trying to say. It's, uh... It's becoming familiar. It's not being as freaky. I'm gonna fall into this, right? Is that the right thing to do? That's raw. I didn't break my legs. This... Damn. I still make it? Yeah. Okay. The, the one thing that this game could benefit from is like a, a small jump. Like even if it's just a hop, like a short hop, that would make this way easier to, to traverse stuff like that. Like small little oopsies and mistakes instead of going all the way back to the beginning. Um, is this just a joke? I think the duck thing is a joke. I can't drop it. I have to use this. There's nothing there. What are they saying here? What does this mean? So the duck thing didn't mean anything. Because there's no duck thing here. to destroy my brain cells. The few brain cells that I have, this is destroying them. <laughs> okay, we're gonna try this again. We know what to do though. So we kinda easy peasy speed run through it. Get there, drop down, boom. Collect this. Shoot this. Run there. Ignore the ducks. I kinda do wanna go to the moon. Let's go to the moon treat myself this definitely the duck thing has like the vibe of a, a museum for sure for sure it does like those little uh, taxidermy things that they got in the museum it feels like that so much 
and I'm starting to pick up like the proper way to place the, the pictures. Place them kind of into the ground a little bit. That way you give yourself like a ramp to go off of. And I see why I'm, I'm kind of getting tilted downwards here. I'm starting to get that. Okay. Maybe we can go back up. Place this up there. Then we can just go up. I'm an idiot. There was a jump this whole time. And I was talking shit about not having a jump. This game is a perfect game. 10 out of 10. Game of the year. Easy. Man, that's crazy. The texture on that is weird. Am I up here? Oh, we need to get on the moon. We need to get on the moon. I like the moon. Let's do that. Let's fall into the moon. Dog, this is raw. This is raw. <laughs> this is raw. I like this. I like this. The end. That's dope. This feels like an episode of the Twilight Zone. Door must be upright. How did I fuck up the ending? Oh my god. Now we got to do that over. <laughs> okay. Whatever, we'll do it over real quick. And we'll get that out the way. Right. I'm surprised though there wasn't... Am I? I'm sliding too far. I'm sliding too far. I'm not going to make it. I'm not going to make it. I'm not going to make it. What? I'm dead, right? I'm jumping. Can I climb up? I'm like, slowly but surely scaling the side. This is what, Ebex Simulator? You know, y'all know what Ibex is, or Ebex, the things that climb up those vertical walls and stuff, and they like lick the, the walls for salt. But we just did that. Except I'm salty. That's the difference. Alright. Sent you there. Let's get out. Game over. Thanks for playing. Ken Forrest, you did an amazing job. I see why this game is going viral right now. That was great. That was a great experience. That was awesome. We need this in like a bigger scale game. Hopefully Ken could bring Ken Forrest could bring that to us. Otherwise, somebody has to do that. That would be such a cool mechanic to see. But yeah, guys, if you enjoyed this, let me know and support me by liking um, and subscribing. You know, the subscription lets me know that you want to see some more of my content, and it'll allow you to do so. So with that being said, guys, I'll see you in the next video. Peace.